it's a small update from the previous video I changed to Pelton wheel and it has been running for a few months now still working fine every day I'm, I'm having around 380 watts constantly but uh, yeah it's it was a temporary uh, build as you can see it's a rug but it's holding this so yeah, yeah at least the water doesn't fall on top but it's it's temporary so let's see Pelton wheel yeah it seems to be in a good shape but uh, yeah it's it's kind of ugly so I came out with this design it's mostly mainly aluminium so uh, the box is made of aluminium the turbo is made of, of aluminium and in my last video the hub that was holding the spoons was in plastic but I switched to aluminium and I put some Loctite the problem with this wheel is that I did not put Loctite and um, the nuts were going off and it's kinda self-destroyed the, the plastic hub so now it's much safer much stronger and for sure there won't be any issue with this and it's yeah it's nicer you should have cleaned it a bit but yeah so came out with this design uh, this is a 40 millimeter I have it there so it will adapt quite easily and yeah it's spinning it's perfect it's ready to replace the other one and uh, yeah let's see if it works well maybe I'll add the second nozzle on the other side so because I have uh, I have a lot of water to use so I will not restrict myself with the water usage so yeah I will replace it and I will see how much I produce as there I'm using a 30 millimeter nozzle uh, I'm, I won't be surprised that I produce a bit less with this one because I'm at 12 millimeter and basically my w water drop is not that high I'm having 12 to 15 meter I'm not sure exactly I say from 10 to 15 because like this I'm in a range but I'm not sure exactly how much drop there is it's from up there I'm not sure how, how many meter I have but uh, as I don't have a lot of drop and it's a Pelton I used bigger nozzle so I use more water but I have less speed because the smaller the nozzle is the more speed you'll wheel will spin but as the motor doesn't necessarily need a lot of uh, rpm rotation per minute it's not always good to have a small nozzle it all kind of depend on, on your water supply because for example with this water supply if I, I, I reduce one time to uh, 8 millimeter and then I did 15 and so on and I, I notice that I produce more with 20 millimeter, 25, 30 millimeter. So yeah, I'll install this one and uh, let's see how it goes. So it's spinning correctly now I need to use a load to check how much I can produce
as expected. It's around 80, 90 watts. It's producing much less because my water drop is too low and the nozzle is small. So if I, if I add a second nozzle, it will produce probably around 200 something, 250. And uh, yeah, it's pretty much the same as this one. But this one, let's check out the nozzle. It's much bigger. Oh yeah, 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 I forgot. It's not even the 30 or 40. It's directly kind of the 40 millimeter of the PVC, the gold here. So it's holding well, the wheel. But yeah, uh, the nozzle is much, much bigger. You can see it's directly going there. So it's around 40 mil millimeter, 380 watt. So I need to increase the nozzle or just add, as I said, the second one or even I can put four and there it will be like producing as much as this one. <laughs> 